All right, we want to get you in the holiday mood, and we have just the way to do it. Yes, listen to the group Sons of Serendip perform Let It Snow. The fire is slowly dying And my dear, we're still good As long as you love me so Let it snow let it snow, let it snow Let it snow, let it snow, Isn't that absolutely gorgeous? Oh, doesn't this make you happy? Yeah, the Sons of Serendip will be performing at the Palace Stamford this Sunday. And today, they are right here in our studio with us. Please say hi to Micah Christian, Cordero Rodriguez, Kendall Ramsdor, and Mason Morton. What? Hi, the, everybody. Uh, well, right, who's got the best voice? Let's just get right <laughs> to it. I'm the lead singer, but uh, this guy has a great voice as well. All right, yeah. and, and, and you all sing, though, or are there, are there just, you, you play? Play, yeah. Okay, yeah, so yeah, do you sing as well? Are you a triple threat? Do you um, dance as well? I sing a harmony once in... Like, once every blue moon? Yeah. Okay. So what's so amazing to me is, like, you guys are Boston boys. You've had regular lives. Uh, who was the teacher in Boston? So, um, all I guess we all kind of talk. Yeah. yeah. We all talk. Yeah. So, I'm actually the only one that's from Boston. Um, Cordero's from North Carolina, Charlotte, North Carolina. He's from Charlotte, North Carolina. These guys actually grew up together. Oh. Um, and Isn't then that Mason's great? from Atlanta. Your Georgia. Childhood dreams of our kind. Did you have a dream as child, as children? Too? I did. You personally. did. Yeah, and you said, yeah, oh, we're going to make this happen. Well, make something happen. Right? <laughs> <laughs> but how did you all, I think it's so interesting, these really talented musicians, but you had other lives. You were teaching, you were doing. How did you all come together to create this amazing group? Yeah, so in 2014, well, we had met at Boston University while in graduate school, and okay. we were studying different things, and um, we had joked about, you know, performing together at some point, uh, because these are the, like, he's the first harpist that I actually met, <laughs> that I knew. Yeah, I don't think I, I, I know I want to be a harpist I, someday. I, to be a harpist I do always say that, but life. I don't know how to play. <laughs> So we graduated, went our separate ways, and we're doing different things. And then in 2014, just on a whim, we sent in an audition tape to America's Got Talent. So it was serendipitous. That, yeah, that's right. where the name comes from. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. Well, it's beautiful. Uh, Thank what, you. Are, are, are you a tenor? Or, I'm a tenor. You're yeah. a tenor, and I'm a baritone. You, you, you I really do. do. <laughs> you really do have that voice, that little voice. <laughs> and uh, obviously, you know, you're doing Christmas songs, but you perform other uh, uh, songs as well, right, throughout the year. Yeah. Tell us what your what what's your genre? Is it is everything that smooth jazzy kind of feel mm -hmm. so I would say we're, we're kind of genre list but um, the, the closest thing is classical crossover classical crossover. yes oh, I like that yeah so we've become cl um, popular for taking popular music rearranging it in our own spin and uh, what's exciting though is that this next phase that we're going into we're, we're getting into more original material mm -hmm. so yeah that, you can hear some new sounds that's great what yeah. was it like being on America's Got Talent it was a lot of fun. Yeah? <laughs> it was, it was. I mean, there were definitely some, some stressful moments. Oh, I can just um, imagine. But it was a lot of fun. We felt so much love uh, from the audience, from the judges. Uh, and we have memories that I, I think will, will last a lifetime. When so. did when did you all start p picking up your instruments, or you knew you had? T you know, was it a young age, six, seven? I know I started playing the trumpet when I was in the fifth grade. I can yeah. still play the Burger King song. Oh, there you go. <laughs> on my trumpet. <laughs> uh, I did cello in, in fifth grade. As fifth well. grade. Yes, uh, yes. But, but you you really had to hone your skills at an early age, right? Absolutely, absolutely. Hours of practice. So, you know, Mason and I can speak to that. Yeah. And, you know, while everyone else was out partying in school, we were in a practice yeah, room alone. <laughs> Amazing. Please, like, oh, 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 I played the harp and I could have fun too. You party after you work. So just so our audience can can hear a little bit more, we actually have another clip of another song you guys have done. I think it's uh, Have Yourself a Merry Little Christmas. Let's oh, listen. Yes. Have yourself a merry little Christmas. Make the Yuletide gay From now on our troubles will be wise away Here we are as in 
All right, self, self-taught, or did you have professional training? Was that what you were doing at BU? Were you yes, mastering yes, my, in music? Right, yes. Okay. And, yeah, and I was studying theology at the time. Theology? Yeah. Isn't that interesting? Yeah, so a lot of my training came from uh, friends um, who are professionals and uh, also like vocal coaches that I've worked with. Vocal coaches. Yeah. That's and, so fantastic. And law for me, and then uh, uh, and law. self-taught. Yeah. <laughs> the law of music? What was, it was, um, it was like, well, I guess it was more focused on criminal law. Criminal, criminal law. law. Yeah. This is okay, so that's just, you have that, and then you go do something that you love. Yeah. Tell us about the concert coming up. Yeah, so the concert coming up. Um, so the, at the Palace Theater, um, we're going to have a mix of Christmas music. Well, actually, it's all be Christmas music. And this Sorry. is the Palace in Stamford. Yeah. We just yes. want to remind everybody because there's a couple of palaces. Because we have a couple of different palaces. palaces. Okay. Yeah. They're all very nice. Terrific. <laughs> yeah, go ahead. Sorry. Yeah, so we'll have a... Um, There'll be some choirs also there that we're collaborating nice. with, and uh, some, and some nice arrangements we have for, with them. Special so. guest uh, performance by me. Um, you guys oh yeah, having, all right. Yeah, you guys. <laughs> you don't know it yet, but I'm singing in your show. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you are more than welcome. That right? is how he asks that. for a role. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Just so you know. <laughs> well, you're all so very talented, and we want to wish you continued success. I mean, what's next for you guys? Are you uh, m- more original work? And yeah, we're working on um, original material right now. We're going to be releasing a single this January um, that was written um, by Cordero, mm-hmm. and um, and then. I'm releasing an EP um, later on that year, 2019, yeah. and it'll be all original music. And uh, and then in January, we're going to be performing, um, f- uh, competing in America's Got Talent, the Champions. Again. That's great. Oh yeah. So. Well, we wish you all the best of luck, and thank you so much for sharing your gifts with us. And yeah. have yourself a merry little Christmas now. All right, the Sons of Serendip are performing this Sunday evening at the Palace Theater in Stamford. And for tickets, all you have to do is head to palacestamford.org. And head to sonsofserendip.com to keep to date with the tour and upcoming television appearances. These guys are on the rise.